Hello everyone, and welcome back. Right, something a little bit different today. We're going to be making pizzas. Now these are tortilla pizzas using these uh, white wraps. Um, you'll see what I mean as we go along. So we've got those, and then I've got some sauce here, some cheddar, cheese, some mozzarella cheese, a bit of baking parchment to put them on, a bit of ham, a bit of pepperoni, and some other bits and bobs. Basically, you can put on these uh, what you like. Your uh, imagination is the only limit. So what we'll do is we'll get these out onto some um, baking parchment and uh, we'll build them and we'll show you what we mean. Okay, so there we have the tortillas. Now, the, the reason I just put them on the baking parchment or greaseproof paper is purely for just ease, really. So you can make them on this um, lift them up on this, cook them on this, and it's just easier when you're trying to get them off. They just should just slide off this onto the plate. So I just make them on this, and then they're easy. You can just grab the sides there, lift them up, put them onto the oven shelf, and then it's just easier to get in and out and get off, really, rather than using a bacon tray, baking tray. Right, the sauce is actually passata. Now, you can get passata in jars or it comes in the small cardboard boxes. I think this one we get from um, other Asda or Audi and that. Um, and what I've done is, is obviously you can see that I've used some of this already, but just put the passata in there. Then I've actually put in a bit of tomato ketchup, just a squeeze of tomato ketchup. You can put a bit of salt, a bit of pepper, um, some tomato puree as well. And then I've, I've used my garlic powder as well. Just give it a good old mix up. Just gives it a bit of flavor. And then what we do is we just uh, give it a bit of a stir and then we put this on the actual tortillas, spread it all out and that's your pizza base. And then you can start adding your toppings. So what I'll do is, because I'm just trying to do it and hold the camera, I'll get the sauce on these tortillas and then we'll start loading up. Okay. Okay, so we're just spreading out the sauce. Now, if you're looking at it thinking, what are those little black bits on there? What's that? Well, that's basically, I've just put a little bit of black pepper on the sauce. So as you can see that one there, so a little bit of black pepper. And then as I spread out the sauce, just a little bit of flavor. I mean, you can add it afterwards if you like. Um, as I say, there's no sort of hard and fast rules with how you do this. Um, you know, you, your sauce, you can have as much or as little as you like and put on it what you want. I mean, we've had this with uh, we're going to put ham on this one. We've got some ham, some pepperoni, a bit of mozzarella, a little bit of cheddar. Uh, we've done it before. We've sort of boiled an egg and had sliced boiled egg on it. And you can say so you can put on it exactly what you like, whatever your topping is. So yeah, we'll just get this spread out, and then we can start adding our toppings. Okay, so there's your prepared bases. Right. Now I'm going to start with ham. I'm going to put a bit of this, uh, it's just wafer, wafer thin ham, put some of that on top and then start adding the pepperoni. Okay, so there's our fully made up pizzas. So on there we've got um, ham, pepperoni, peppers, a bit of buffalo mozzarella, sprinkling of cheddar cheese and um, it'll just put a bit of onion on there as well, just a bit of that frozen onion. Now bear in mind that these uh, tortillas do come in packs of eight. So by the time you've gone and bought yourself um, the peppers, they come in three, so you could buy the frozen peppers, um, thing of ham, the pepperoni, the passata, I mean the little the box of passata that we get, um, that does all the eight pizzas. So it works out quite a cheap way of doing it. Um, right, so cooking. Now these, I know I always say about the air fryer, but unfortunately, apart from either folding them in half or using mini tortillas, I wouldn't be able to get these in the air fryer, of course, so that is the only thing with these, is they are better off in the oven. Um, so the oven, so these ones, we cook them at 180, and we've found anywhere between 11 and 12 minutes. So what I'd probably do is, our oven's a little bit older, um, so I'd say 180, and put them in for 10, and just check them for 10, because they do tend to if you leave them in for too long, they go a bit sort of burn around the edges. But um, we've found that anywhere between 11 and 12 minutes, 180 is perfect, absolutely ideal. And it gets all the toppings nice and cooked as well. So we'll get these in the oven, get them cooked and uh, show you the results. Okay. 
so there we have it. That is the um, finished article. As you can see, we kept it on the paper. That is a bit of an awkward bit, getting it out of the oven on the paper, but if you just grab it to the edges, as you can see, when you get it to the plates, that should, there we go, just slide right off. And there's your pizza. So there you go. So that's homemade tortilla pizzas. Enjoy.